Hi there everybody, I'm Laura Burke, I'm here from Gaming Trend, and today we're going to take a look at some recipes out of the new official Destiny cookbook. Let's get cooking. Hi there. Okay, so for the first recipe, this one takes the longest to do and it's for dessert. So what I'm going to do is I am going to prep all of my ingredients for this White Traveler's chocolate that we are going to do today. And I'll show you right here. So it requires some white chocolate chips, some coconut cream, unsalted butter, vanilla extract, orange zest, salt, and vanilla candy coating. So we're gonna get started on that on our stove here. I've already put my coconut cream in there and I've already pre-measured my uh, white chocolate chips. So we're gonna get started. I'm gonna show you the process to melt down our chocolate chips. I've got a non-stick pot here with my coconut cream. Pre-measured my chocolate chips. We've got this on a low heat. Shouldn't take very long. Normally, I would use a double boiler for something like this, but I am doing exactly what the recipe asks for. So I just figured I would use my nonstick. Trying to combine that coconut cream. And I don't want the chocolate to sit and melt. I want to keep it moving so it melts evenly and doesn't burn. And that looks like that's about it. All right, take it off the heat. Okay, so now that we've done all that, what we're gonna do is we put two tablespoons of our butter and we are going to add our newly combined chocolate mixture. Make sure you get all that yummy yummy goodness. Alright and next we've got one teaspoon. Okay, so we have one teaspoon of vanilla. And we have two tablespoons of orange zest. That is an awful lot of orange zest and I don't know if the orange that I have gave me enough. Always practice good hygiene when you're cooking. Okay, and this says one teaspoon of salt, which seems an awful lot of salt, but I'm gonna sprinkle there. Now we're gonna mix. And this is gonna have to chill in the fridge for three hours, three. So when you do this, give yourself a lot of prep time.
All right. All right, now we're gonna cover it and let it sit in the fridge for three hours. We'll be back. Okay, so we're at the point where we're going to start forming our balls and this is our chilled, I don't know what you wanna call it, concoction. <laughs> so we're gonna take it and now it's nice and firm and we're gonna try to make little truffles out of it. And roll it into these little balls. And then you're gonna put it back in the refrigerator for another 30 minutes to make sure that they've firmed up all the way. from chilling for about another 30 minutes. Uh, we have warmed up our white candy coating for 30 second increments until it started to melt. Once it started to move, you pull it out of the microwave and just mix it until everything is nice and smooth. Now that that's all nice and smooth, now I'm mixing it around so it cools off just a little bit so we don't end up melting our balls. <laughs> <laughs> can't say balls. Melting <laughs> art. Oh, I think you could say balls plenty. <laughs> okay, back to the balls. <laughs> okay, so let's see. What's the easiest way to do this? I think I'm just going to pick it up and drop it in and then put it back. No, that'll probably make more of a mess. Now that we've finished our white chocolate traveler, thanks so much for joining us. Hit that like and subscribe and we'll see you again soon.